Hello creative folks. Today we're going to learn how to do smooth reverse effect. First of all, drag your footage on the timeline window and just and adjust it according to your need. Next, we're gonna create some space to work with and for this, hold the old key and scroll it up to increase the height of the track. Or you can use hover over your mouse and you can see the icon and drag it up. That's also cool. Now, right click on the footage, show clip keyframes, time remapping and then speed. Now you can see new speed adjustment line in the center of the track. If you drag this line up, you will get a speed increase. If you drag it down, it slows it down. Now go to the point where you're gonna freeze your footage. I think that's that's fine. Yeah, by holding the control key, click on the point, it will create a new adjustment point. Now drag down this line to zero to freeze the footage. We can create a smooth transition between the speeds by moving the second adjustment point away from the first one. Now delete rest of the clip after the freezing point and next delete rest of the in the previous one as well. Next you have to hold the old key on your keyboard and drag your clip on the right to duplicate the layer. Now right click on the second clip, go to the speed duration, click reverse speed and change the time interpolation to optical flow for smooth transitions. And you have to change the inter time interpolation for the first clip as well into, into optical flow for smooth transition. Now hit enter to render the files. And that's it for this tutorial. Make sure to like and subscribe if you're not already.